Hey, perfume lover. This is Bob coming to you live from the Pacific. I just unboxed this M7 Oud Absolute. I think it's the last iteration of it. Uh, it changed in 2011 to the square black uh, uh, bottle and then probably went to this clear one. And in the, originally it was the, uh, I think in 2002, that, uh, that slim, um, slender bottle that originally came out, that reddish bottle that came out uh, from Yves Saint Laurent, the real Yves Saint Laurent, the, uh, the powerhouse, say like back in the 80s. When my family were wearing opium, either my sister or my mother, I can't remember, but I remember the bottles, the kind of like the oriental style bottle of opium. But uh, this is the first time I've had this and smell it. And uh, like I said, I just unboxed it and I sprayed it on my fingers and I like it. Kind of a uh, earthy patchouli leather with a citrus top, like an orangey top. This this could be wood, I think, but. Definitely classy, definitely. Um, like a, a new pair of very nice Italian shoes right out of the box. That's how I uh, interpret fine scents like this uh, with a touch of oud. Um, but it, it screams leather to me most. It's, uh, orange on top and a dank earthiness as the spine of this fragrance. So can see uh, wearing this in the evening or to a social event, out to dinner, or uh, um, maybe like uh, to some of the theater or the uh, opera or to the movies, but to, to work and casual, mm, nah, it's kind of dress up. In my opinion um, so the citrus it's a light fragrance uh, for a beginner it might be a little medium fragrance but it's a light fragrance because of the citrus and but it has um, a significant uh, a base uh, and backbone to it because of the, uh, the patchouli amber and uh, hint of oud in my opinion so glad I got this after all these years and um, you can see someone wearing this throughout the year on a cool summer evening uh, all the way to a winter day or a fall day um, someone's gonna do some light housework put a sweater on and then he's already showered and shaved and then from there he's gonna go out to dinner. Uh, love this. I wish Yves Saint Laurent was still like this. And, uh, you know, things change and they're obviously not. So definitely a recommendation to uh, get your nose on this. And YSL lovers, I would say uh, this is a must uh, try. Uh, YSL collectors, it's a must, must have. I think ladies would love to smell this. Love to smell this on a man or wear it themselves. So check it out. Uh, I'll, add, I'll put this right next to my La Nuit de Lome, my jazz, um, my live jazz, and my Reeve Gauche. So let me know what you think about M7 Oud Absolute, which bottle you have, which presentation, and uh, give me some pointers. All right. So, uh, Fabio signing out, and I'll catch you later in the next uh, Perfumes in Paradise. Bye-bye.